Welcome back to 84A2 Media. Today, I'm going to quickly show you guys the best export settings for Instagram Reels. So you have a couple of videos that you want to upload to Instagram and you want it to be the correct frame size. This is how you do it on DaVinci Resolve 19. So initially, once you have created a new project, you'll have a timeline, right? And this is where you grab the clips and you add them to the timeline. I already have a clip right here. Now to adjust it perfectly for Instagram Reels, we go to our master control folder that's right over here and right where it says timeline two or timeline one, we're going to right click on it, go to timeline, timeline settings, click on that. And now we want to make sure that right underneath format, we type in 1080 by 1920. Click OK. And now what we're going to see is that it changed the frame size. Now, sometimes it doesn't zoom in like it does here. We want to make sure that this clip is selected and then click on video. And sometimes it's going to look like this once you change the format settings, right? Um, if that's the case, select the video, go to video underneath transform settings. You can just zoom in and change that size. Okay, so once that's done, we can go to the deliver page, go underneath custom export, give this uh, timeline a name, the location of where it's going to export to, make sure the uh, format is uh, MP4 with a codec of 0.264. And now the important part, where it says quality, this is the bit rate. We want to make sure the bit rate is no more and no less than 5,000. Now we click to add render queue. It's going to come to our render queue, job four. We're going to click render one and it's going to be successfully exported to your files. So thank you guys for watching. If this video was helpful, please leave a like down below. If you have any questions, comment down below. Again, thanks for watching and have a great day.